I usually come right here and cut right across the tail. Get it started right there. Go on, Jack. Lacey doesn't like the heads. No. A little bit of shot. So I, this is how I skin mine. I always start back here. And then I got this little gizmo right here. It's kind of neat. I put its feet in there in those two little slots. Come down here and get a hold of that. Work it right off there. Let's break that leg. Break this one. always cut that off because I want to put this head in this other slot. That way you keep, when you cut that off, you keep that loose hair off there. So this is how I skin mine. I've skinned them across the back. To me, it's just a lot easier doing them this way. I really like this tool. A guy in Virginia made them. And Jack likes the heads. <laughs> I just usually start right here at the back leg and, and cut that up. Whatever's there, cut that off. And then I split him all the way up. I just usually break those ribs open. The dogs get them, they're not, not much meat on And I just pull that all out. There it is. Boom. So then I got a, a lot of people like gravy, squirrel to squirrel and gravy. But we like dumplings. So we got an old recipe, an old family recipe. Hillbillies has been eating squirrel and dumplings and gravy and biscuits for many, many, many generations of us. So not too many of us left anymore. But we got some squirrels. We're going to have some squirrel and dumplings and biscuits and probably mashed potatoes and green beans. Good to go. Looks like we're at war. Let's go and see if we can find You want me to get your shell house for you? Yeah. 